Hi, I'm Shiva from JustPay. In this video, we will discuss how to configure gateway priority logic for JustPay payment router. We'll cover the following topics in this video. Why is priority logic needed? What are the priority rules that can be configured? How to configure priority logic on the dashboard? Finally, we'll recap what we discussed. So let's begin. Why is priority logic needed? When a transaction flows through a payment method like UPI and only one payment gateway is present, there is a risk of losing out on transactions when there is a gateway downtime. It is for this reason that it's advisable to have fallback gateways. Once fallback gateways are configured, the transactions will be routed to a suitable gateway to ensure the transactions are successful. In order for you to have control over ranking the gateways, we designed priority logic. So what is priority logic? Priority logic is a set of rules to define logic based on which transactions can be switched from one gateway to another. The advantages of having priority logic are many. Let me explain them to you. The first one is managing fallback gateways. We have a module called simple configuration using which you can rank all your gateways. If gateway 1 is down, transactions will flow to gateway 2. Similarly, using advanced configuration, you can add even more granular details on what type of transactions need to flow through each gateway. The second advantage is managing commercials. If you have a commitment that 60% of your overall volume has to go through gateway A and the remaining 40% have to flow via gateway B, you can configure the same using configurator. The third one is owner's routing. Owner's routing means issuing bank transactions going to same acquiring bank. For example, HDFC card transactions going to HDFC acquiring gateway. This also helps in commercials. What are the priority rules that can be configured using JustPay Priority Logic Configurator? You can configure priority logic that can distribute volumes based on commitment to gateways. Using this configurator, you can build rules to minimize merchant discount rate cost. You can build rules on payment related elements like card type, net banking, saved cards, etc. You can build rules as per business priorities such as order amount, currency, etc. Well, now that we discussed the use cases of Gateway Priority Logic Configurator, let's understand how to configure Gateway Priority Logic in JustPay dashboard. Before proceeding to Priority Logic Configuration, ensure that the required gateways through which transactions are to be routed are configured and enabled in JustPay dashboard. After logging into the JustPay dashboard, navigate to the EC Operations tab in the navbar. Click on Priority Logic. Here, the module is divided into two parts. First half shows the active priority logic. Second half consists of two tabs specifying simple as well as advanced configurations. You can choose either simple or advanced configuration. We will start with the simple configuration. If you choose simple configuration, you can easily define primary and secondary gateways. In simple words, if the primary gateway is down, then the transaction will be processed by secondary gateway. Example, if bill desk is down, then PayU will process transactions. Let's try to configure a simple priority logic through dashboard where primary gateway is Paytm underscore V2, secondary gateway is Razorpay and tertiary gateway is PayU. Steps involved in simple configuration are as follows. Click on plus add gateway. Choose gateways for which you wish to define priorities. I'm choosing Razorpay, Paytm V2 and PayU. Once done, rearrange the priorities according to the ones that we discussed. So first is Paytm V2. The second one is Razorpay. I click and drag it to the second position. And the third one is pay you. Click on activate config. For simple priority logics, no approval is needed to activate priority logic. Logic will be configured and activated at the same time. 
Now that we completed simple configuration, let's move to advanced configuration. As one rule cannot fit all, we have advanced configurations where depending on business requirements, users can write custom priority logics. Steps for advanced configuration. Click on plus new configuration button to create advanced priority logic. Enter the name and description of the configuration. Let's try to configure an advanced priority logic through dashboard for the following use case. Condition 1. Route all debit card transactions equally between two gateways, PayU gateway and RazorPay. Condition 2. Route all credit card transactions through PayU. Condition 3. Add Go Cash Free as default gateway. There are two options of adding the advanced priority logic configuration. One is rule based UI and the other is code based. Rule based. This is a UI based configuration where custom rules can be easily added to configure a priority logic. Code based is writing a groovy logic for the priority logic configuration. Let's try the rule based UI for this video. Once we click on rule based UI, click on plus add rule button. Add the logic using UI. Before we do that, let's recollect what is our first use case. We wanted to route all debit card transactions equally between two gateways, PayU gateway and RazorPay. For the first case, select field and choose card type. In value, choose debit. Add PayU and RazorPay in gateways. Click on distribute and assign a percentage of 50% each. Now, the second condition was to route all credit card transactions through PayU. So repeat the same process for credit card by clicking on plus add new rule button. I chose card type and credit in value and let me add PayU in the gateway. The next condition was to use Go Cash Free as the default gateway. So in the default gateway section, add Go Cash Free. Click on send for approval. Advanced configurations are complex rules and hence require approval from admins before activation. Once a merchant submits the priority logic, JustPay support team will review the syntax and correctness of logic and then approve it. Logic will be effective as soon as it is approved by the JustPay team. Under the advanced configuration tab, the list of configured priority logics is displayed. The priority logic with status equal to approved can be activated as per business requirement. Congratulations on learning how to configure priority logic. Over and above the priority logic, JustPay optimizes for any uncertainties in your payment performance. This is done using our dynamic routing feature. Our dynamic routing algorithm ranks all gateways based on parameters like gateway health, historical performance, etc. Combining the gateway ranking and priority logic, gateway is chosen such that the probability of successful transaction is highest. Let's now recap what we discussed. We discussed that priority logic is the set of rules to define logic based on which transactions can be routed from one gateway to another. The logic can be defined based on business requirements like payment instrument, commercials, volume, etc. We then moved on how to configure priority logic on our dashboard. We discussed two flows. The first one being simple configuration and the second one being advanced configuration. We created mind maps for the steps we discussed so that you can use it for reference while using our configurator. Simple configuration had four steps. We then moved to advanced configuration. 
Our key goal was to route all debit card transactions equally between two gateways, PayU and RazorPay. The second condition was to route all credit card transactions through PayU. And finally, we wanted to add GoCash Free as default gateway. We configure the above through the following 11 steps. We hope that you found this session useful. As always, please share your feedback to support at JustPay.in so that we can make the video sessions more useful. Thank you and have a great day.